Hey, Bob Bobson 6868 here, and as you all know, or you should know by now, the new Revolution Map Pack has released on Black Ops 2. Now, I don't really know what the deal was today, but um, it seemed like I had lag in every single game I played, and it really, it was really frustrating. And so I did play some of the maps, and I did play some regular, uh, just regular core, and some hardcore, and... You know, I wasn't I wasn't having a lot of fun today just because of the connections, but I wanted to show you this map just because uh, I think this is the most ridiculous <laughs> ball map ever made because it is just so ridiculously complicated and there's just so many places to camp and so many little buildings and corners and head glitch. Um, maybe not head glitch. The head glitches I think aren't quite as bad on this map. But it's just ridiculously overcomplicated, and I just kind of want to give you a tour of it. And um, this is where your B flag would be on domination. Um, but for some reason, uh, three of the four maps really seem like circles, where you're basically um, all your all your stuff's happening on the outside of the map. You can't really uh, run around the map and flank. It's just that's where everything happens. Uh, on this map, there's just that one building in the middle, and in my experience, it's not a whole lot of action that takes place in the middle, because it's just like that one little building, and you know, it's kind of a trap to run in there. Sometimes I will go to the doors and kind of shoot in, but I really don't like to run through it, just because uh, it's it's in there too, it's easy for someone to hide, and um, right over, not over here, to uh, right over where I'm going is uh, either your A or C flag, I can't remember. I thought I might get uh, in trouble if I came in here because it says uh, restricted access, but nothing happened, so. Um, yeah, this was supposed to be like a map where a sandstorm came in and took over. I think basically left this uh, little uh, hotel or resort or whatever in ruins, but um, I would say not a lot of action in, in this area. Um, I think the flag is uh, right up here somewhere. This is like a triangle pattern flags, which which is interesting. I, I don't care for the triangle though. Uh, hard hat was a triangle on Modern Warfare 3, and it just made it really hard because you know there's no real B side. It's just three sides, and that's it. <laughs> uh, you could go from A to B, B to C, A to C. It all takes the same amount of time. Uh, a lot of action does take place right in this area. You're gonna have a lot of people hiding behind this van. Uh, trying to head glitch you. Uh, it, it's kind of hard to shoot them. Uh, I do like to go on that roof back there to my right. Kind of a good spot. As you can, see, And this is uh, kind of the area where the other flag is. But uh, like I said, um, this big huge hotel, that's the only bedroom. <laughs> uh, I don't think you can get upstairs. But like I said, it's just over complicated. I mean, can you really check a, a million corners while you're running around? Just, just expect to get shot in the back a lot on this map um, basically non-stop you're gonna get shot in the back and it's it's really difficult to come up with a strategy just because you know it's it's ridiculous I don't understand why they would make the map so complicated I would say out of the four maps this is definitely my least favorite just because of um, the way it is set up but at least on this map you don't necessarily have to worry about um, anything in the map killing you there's no uh, anything in the map to kill you I think the skate park doesn't have one either, but the other two have, you know, how Treyarch likes to do. They're, th they're things in the map to kill you, so, um, the little swimming pool, I, I, I realize you, you can get up there, it's just, you gotta do it just right. Another little camping spot. I mean, they're everywhere. <laughs> uh, so, so basically, pretty displeased with this map, and I think it's the worst in the DLC, and probably one of the worst, uh, in the game, but, um... A little, a little less head glitching spots. Maybe they listened to the community and that they're tired of all the head glitching spots, like they built into the original maps. But um, did you guys get the DLC? This is also the new peace, peacekeeper, peacemaker. God, why do they have to give it such a stupid name? Whatever it is, I think it's the peacekeeper uh, gun. It's okay. I really don't care for the sound of it. And I, I was using it first, but then everybody's using it, so I, I kind of try to stay away from it. But it just kept beating me every time. Far away it beats you, up close it beats you. I think it definitely needs to be patched already, but um, that's just my opinion. Thanks for watching, see you next time.